Look at all this amazing material they just threw out. Well, I see your cardboard and fabric remnants. Exactly. Now, to don thy armor. Let's don away. Great. I'll just put this here, that there, and done. Your first LARP outfit. Had to use the last of my duct tape, but it was worth it. At least it's comfortable. Here, this is the LARP weapon I used when I started out. I'd like to pass it on to you. Oh, thank thee? Try it out. Shoot someone. Um, okay. I'm so good, I surprised myself. See? The whole city plays the dust move. They die a worthy death, they get on with their day. Weird, but cool. Now you're ready to play. Let's go join House Dust Storm. Why ain't I ever heard of this LARP stuff before now? I have no idea. You never heard Gwen Terrio talk about it? Wait, Gwen plays this? My old CO Gwen? Yeah. She runs House Phoenix. Why don't I just shoot whoever ain't you? Shoot? LARP shoot. There they are. Let's park and walketh on foot. Do mine eyes deceive me? What brings Elijah the Wise to the land of Tapeworm? Seek ye to join with the Great Worm? Nay, I am here on behalf of House Duststorm. <laughs> Lies. We know thou art houseless. Duststorm shall welcome us with open arms, once we torch thy beacon. Yeah! On guard, shitlords! You can't handle all of us! Down for the count! <gasps> welcome me to your- Now, we light the beacon on fire and await Tapeworm's arm response. Hell yeah! Home with Mama. Don't! Pew, pew. Ah. Man, would you watch where you're shooting? Ah. Accept your beating! Later, Gator. You are no match for my character. Is that you? I'm gonna wreck you! Out of ammo already? Speaking of Blaze, now we just need to inform Fort Dustor. We could do that. Or we could start our own house. Be thine own lord. Sounds nice, but we need to build a fort first. So we build a fort. With what? Tapeworm bought all the duct tape in the city to keep people from doing exactly that. It's a cheap move, but technically legal. So we storm their fort and take their supply. Really? Verily. Noticed. We could get them to invite us in. That's genius! Let me do the talking. Halt! Who goes there? Tis I, Elijah the Wise, and... Quick, wh what's your character's name? I don't know. And... Bosonius the Bloody! What business had thee here? I wish to... to join with the Great Worm! Huzzah! Thou hast seen reason and rejected the ways of the dust storm? Aye, they are dicks, and I shall rejoice when they are crushed. Enter, friend. We shall watch their destruction together. All right, now just play it cool until I give the signal. Wait for it. Wait for it. Attack! Your four just got preggers. Treachery! Taking you down. That one. 
hand to her. Welcome me to your bosom. My battle is lost, but the war continues. Wonk. Run and tell the others! Elijah hath risen! I'll salt the earth with you. My comrades will avenge me. Yo, how much are we spinning on bullets? Not so good, I surprised myself. Mama, is that you? I am Balsonius the Badassist! Down for the count. The Great Worm's treasure hoard must be close. Check on yonder pedestal. Just ammo, no duct tape. Then we must search the ruins of this fort. Touch that! That's not loot! Okay, calm down. I won't touch it. Hey, Eli, what's this $2.99 stuff? Tis but a microtransaction. Check thine coin purse for funds. Why is there a box of bottle caps? Huzzah! You have found quite the fortune. Not seeing any duct tape, Eli. The loot must be in the belly of the great tapeworm itself. You must slay the beast to retrieve the treasure. That's the rules. Oh. <laughs> I shall enter through its gullet. And I shall wait here, for I am claustrophobic. To kill the beast, you must burst the polyps inside. Polyps? I can't tell if that's disgusting or awesome. I think they did it for colon cancer awareness month, and then it just stuck. Ugh. I'm dead, so I'm gonna lay on the floor. Later, Gator. I have seen my death, and this. Is it? Uh, 
Bye bye, Birdie. Talk to me to your bosom. Oh. 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 the trash This is a shit ton of duct tape. Fell beast, void me from thy fundament. Oh, got the duct tape. I guess we're gonna create our own house. Aye, together we shall burn Gwen and House Phoenix into ash and have a fun bonding experience, right? Yes, that too. Now I 
really want a taco. There you are. So, how do we staff up? Easy. I've got a 14-step plan. Sounds about 13 steps too many. Yeah. Why not just go to Boot Hill and show everyone what a badass you are? What's Boot Hill? Are you kidding me? Check out the laptop. Okay. Boot Hill is this live stream fight club kind of thing they do on the abandoned island out in this the This sick cat named Doc Ketchum runs the show. Fight club? More like murder service. We need to recruit more saints, right? Everyone in town with a criminal record watches this live oh, stream. Oh, he's right. I've seen Pantero streaming it. I just didn't know what it was called. But it's crazy dangerous. It's viral marketing. Viral marketing is not supposed to come with a mortality rate. It's like breaking out in the art world. You gotta do something to capture people's attention. This Plus does. Plus it nails our target demographic. I don't know. You're the one who have to do this. What do you think? Y'all had me at murder circus. You sure? We cannot afford to lose you. Also, you're our friend. And we'd miss you. Chill out, buddy. I was born for this. Sweet. There's a ferry to the island that docks out back. We can do this whenever you're ready. Let's go join the murder circus. Sign up for this. Did they get new startup? We've got new blood making moves today, folks. This boot hill is gonna be a good one. Stay tuned, Just what the doc ordered. The all new do it yourself surgery dating show coming out this fall. Dead 
as a doornail. myself. Well, 
Don't get us new recruits, nothing will. Christ, so that's what being good at murder means. I know. Seeing it on the leaderboard really puts things in perspective. Should we be scared or reassured? Why not both? Eli, mute your fucking phone. Oh, yeah. Holy shit. Holy shit. These just keep coming in. Who are they from? People who are watching. They want to learn from the master. You know what that means. We got recruits? We got recruits. We got recruits! <laughs> 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 
Hey, I heard you had a LARP hit for me? Great, Bessonius! We beseech you to destroy the necromancer that has taken control of the graveyard. Listen close. The necromancer is a traitorous ass. We once shared a raiding party, but when I was attacked and passed into the great beyond, she did not revive me. We were friends. She had the resources to save me, but she let my favorite character die. I shall see to it that she feels the pain of re-rolling. Sword. How dare you disturb the great necromancer! The hour of your demise is at hand, foul fiend! You shall rue the day you backstabbed your friend! Protect me, thralls! To battle! Karma hath come for you! upon my dark arts. Do your worst. I cast the spell of mass resurrect. Arise, my thralls. Are you fucking kidding me? No wonder she put a hit out on you. You're powerful enough to save your whole raiding party, but you chose not to. Hey, I worked hard on this character, and betraying my party is what my character would do. And I can only cast it once per day, so just suck it up. Fine, whatever. All my thralls have fallen to dust. I myself must take arms against the higher sword! You can't kill me because I quit! I'm gonna join the LARP in Maker City! They actually like narrative twists and betrayal plot lines. Cool. You do you. Your revenge hath been fulfilled. She's off to join another LARP. Good. The door can't hit her where the gods hath split her. Let's go get my car back. You want the wheel? And try not to drive angry. So, any idea where they took your car? If they stole it, they're gonna chop it. But you know Sergio. I want to make it personal first. Take it for a spin, drag racing. Show the Panteros who's boss. Most likely place he'd do that is at the culvert in Smelterville. Hopefully we can catch him there before he carves it up. He knows what that car means to me. Damn. I don't know if I ever said this in so many words, but that guy is a first-rate turf bucket. You've spent hours on that car. I've spent years on that car. That's why he took it. As far as he's concerned, I didn't betray Los Panteros. I betrayed him. He's gotta make it hurt. I don't get it. If someone betrayed me, I'd just, you know, bang. Not that I wanted to do that to you, just seems easier. That's not how it works in Los Panteros. You shoot someone in the face, they're dead. You fuck up their car, they're nothing. Here's the culvert. They ain't gonna be happy to see you. Whatever. As long as I get my car. 
¡Oye, cabrones! ¿Dónde está mi carro? ¿Qué? ¡Es Nina! This is what happens when you touch our stuff. Where's the... Where's my car? Let's add some blaze! Uh. You got no place here anymore! Knocking them down. Ugh. You really want to die over her old car? I'm on a whole other level. Give me back my fucking car! Find cover! Move around them! Burn them to the ground! You assholes are gonna regret picking this fight! Need to reload! They deserve that. Tell her what she wants to know. I'm done asking politely. I don't see your car. Damn it, it's not here. We must already be chopping. We've got to get to the garage. Let's go. They could be chopping my car up right now. Pissed. Hola, Gabriel. Where's my car? It's not here. No digas pendejadas. We both know you chop Sergio's special projects. Don't look like he's gonna talk. He's our only fucking lead. Wait, what was it you said about Los Panteros? Shoot one in the face and they're dead. But fuck up their car, and they're nothing. Wait, what? My car! What are you doing? That was my grandma's bumper! Okay, okay, I'll talk. Sergio took your car to the quarry. What? Oh no, 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 no. We gotta go, we gotta go now. Oh, what the fuck? I just spilled the beans. Drive now to the quarry. I don't get it. What does that mean? What's the quarry? It means Sergio doesn't want to chop my car. He doesn't even want to sell it for scrap. You mean he's gonna... Right over the edge. There's no fixing that. We don't stop him. That turd bucket. Hang on, we got all kinds of Panteros up our ass. Wrong turn, Holmes! Please, 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 please. Cover me! Please. We'll get there in time. Bye-bye, 
Antero's ain't gonna stop us now. Don't let anything slow you down. I'm already gone. We're getting close. Step on it. I reckon we really got their goat on this one. I drove that car all the way here from Guadalajara. My family's so far away, you know. It felt like I was keeping part of them with me. She never let anyone else drive that car. Who? My mom. But when Kimo made her weak, I drove her around. Ah, uh, fuck. I promised her I'd take care of that car. Ella confiaba en mí. Let's go. We can still catch up to him. Nah. If Sergio's gonna fuck with my family, I'm gonna fuck with his. <laughs> <laughs> 